love. That's the great commandment. Love one another as I have loved you. Love God above all, all things. There's nothing like love which gives life. To be loved means to be given life by others. To love others means giving life to others. Love the Lord your God. Love one another. Do you love your neighbor as yourself? Do you really love God above all things? Do you believe in him? Do you have faith in God and faith? There are strange people that are mentioned in the Beatitudes. The poor, the hungry, the thirsty, the naked, the persecuted, the rejected and hated. All these are mentioned. We must love them. How can we bring happiness to such people? Well, we have a song in Jamaica. Uh, the time to be happy is now. The place to be happy is here. And the way to be happy is to make others happy and to build God's kingdom right here. What wisdom! Such a simple, simple little song. We are happy when we give our lives to others. And we are happy when we receive the sorrows of each other. It seems so difficult. And yet it is when we lift that burden of other people's sorrow, that we're happiest. And at the same time, you make other people very happy. God loves you, brothers and sisters. Do you love him? God wants you to love. Do you love others, even the most forgotten and rejected of people? There are people who hate you. Do you love your enemies? There are those who are rejected and lonely. Do you visit them? If you visit them, they will feel the presence of Christ coming through you to them and bringing about great joy. There are those whose souls are craving for love. Do you understand, brothers and sisters, how meaningful it is every single minute of the day, every hour of the day, every morning, every evening, all that can be given in love. The Beatitudes, that's the new commandment of Jesus Christ. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.